Come with me to the Art Squad event at the Camp Store in New York City. In the first room I went in, there was a huge photo op and all of the dolls. And you were able to make a bracelet. Andy is the doll that represents the bracelets. So technically I was making one with her and I made mine, of course, say Mad Dolls. And after being in the New York City heat, this was actually so nice and relaxing. I had so much fun. The next room I went into, you got to design and color your own art squad bag. And there were drinks and refreshments and it was so nice. Down the stairs was the rest of the store and I checked out the doll. The art squad dolls come with so many accessories. It is crazy. Look at them all. Here are all of the art squad dolls unboxed. Huge thank you to Just Play and the Art Squad for having me to the camp event in New York City where I got all of these awesome dolls. And please go check out my other videos unboxing everyone and reviewing everyone way more detailed. Today I am just going to be ranking. Now when I first saw the dolls, this was the order that I thought they would be in for my ranking from first place to last place. But now after getting the dolls and unboxing them and being up close with them and playing with them, my rankings have changed. On last place, I do sadly think it is Nini. Ah, uh, I really, really like her though. She just, I don't know. I feel like the others kind of have more going on with them. Um, more details, more cohesive. So she is sadly at the end of my rankings. I do, however, really like her top. I really like her hair. So now in third place, I think we do have Lady T. I really like her color palette a lot, but I'm not kind of, I'm not, not loving the pants. Now her shoes though, she has the best shoes out of every single doll here. They are the best shoes I've seen in a long time on a doll. So she gets third place and second place. Drum roll, please. We have Vanna. She was my first favorite for a long time, but I also feel like compared to Andy, Andy just has kind of more going on that just makes me like Andy a little bit more, but this is very, very close. They are very closely tied. I really have no complaints with Vanna. I love everything about her. Maybe a few more details in her shorts, but like that is picking nits. Now Andy is in first place. I absolutely love Andy. I think she is so pretty. I love the colors, I love the hair, and I'm a sucker for yellow, so maybe it's a little biased. But there you guys go, that is my ranking of the new Art Squad dolls. Really, really like these dolls overall. I think they are so fun, and I love that you get to do art with them. I am a big art girl. Art is like my second favorite thing in life after dolls. So this was just an awesome combination of a doll series for me personally. Definitely recommend that everyone goes and checks them out.